Hello everybody, this is Karthik from Zunroof. Electricity bill is something which we get every month without fail. You could skip a few of them if you go solar with Zunroof. Anyways, let's explore the BSES electricity bill many of us receive in Delhi. Bills from other discoms such as NDPL, NPCL and DHBVN in Delhi NCR region are similar. Let's go through the obvious things first. This is name, address and phone number of the connection holder. Please ensure your mobile number is correct as a lot of BSES services are available online and on their app. Sanction load. This is the maximum load you are allowed to put on the grid. Monthly fixed charge in your bill is determined based on the sanction load. Higher the sanction load, higher the fixed charges in the bill. This is your customer account number. This is a unique account number associated with your connection. You should use this number if you ever want to contact BSES. This can also be used to fetch your electricity bill details online. This is power factor, a technical parameter calculated on the basis of your consumption pattern. You don't need to worry about it as long as it is above 0.9. If it is below 0.9, get in touch with us. You're basically paying at least 20% extra electricity bill plus penalty charged by BSES. This is where you find meter type. Meters are either one phase or three phase. It is good to know but largely irrelevant for a common man. This part refers to bill basis. If a working meter was available for taking measurement, it would be on actual basis. Otherwise, it would be pro rata based on your consumption history. This table provides details of your consumption in current billing cycle based on your last two meter readings. This is real stuff you are being charged for. Fixed charge. This is based on sanction load and connection type. Electricity units charges. Cost of actual units consumed by the consumer. For residential customers, it is typically slab based. Arrears. Any adjustment based on last bill charge and payment. Energy tax. This is an energy tax of 5% on electricity units charges which every customer has to pay. Surcharge. This is 8% on electricity units charges in Delhi NCR. An average customer ends up paying 13% in taxes which no one often realizes. This is the security deposit you paid when you applied for an electricity connection. Theoretically, you will get it back when you will close your account. However, please do let us know if you have met someone who got it back. Just kidding. You can look into tariff structure for your connection. To add just a bit of complexity, BSES provides tariff structure for all other types of connections as well. Let's go through it for domestic customers. You are charged 4 rupees per unit plus 13% tax up to 200 units, 5.95 rupees per unit plus 13% tax from 200 to 400 units, 7.3 rupees per unit plus 13% tax from 400 to 800 units, 8.1 rupees per unit plus 13% tax from 800 to 1200 units, effective rate is 9.15 per unit. 8.75 rupees per unit plus 13% tax above 1200 units. Effective rate is 9.9 per unit. You can look into your historic consumption for past 6 months. This is on page 2 so you don't get a shock on how much you are paying as electricity bill. If your electricity bill is higher than 2500 rupees consistently, you should consider going solar with Zunroof. Please go through the blog to find the bill used in the video and relevant details in text format. We will soon post a blog on NDPL, NPCL and DHBVN bills.